Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your boy Trey Fragrances, man, and I'm back with another banger. If you guys new to the channel, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and turn your post notification because I will be posting my content for you guys. And I hope every last one y'all out there are having a great day. Um, and I hope y'all out there feeling good, looking good, dressing good, and most importantly of all, smelling good. So. Without further ado, let's get straight into this vid. Now, this vid, uh, I will be talking about this fragrance that I used to have, but it is a gift to me from my girl, which I love her so much. Um, we have one million elixir. So I used to have this fragrance, guys, like I say, but I literally forgot how it smelled. But all I know is it smelled so good. I just forgot, you know, the scent of it. So we're gonna get straight into the unboxing. And as y'all already know, you already know we, what we gotta do with the box. All right, one million elixir. Look at that. Look at that. That triangle with the one. Man, Paco Rabanne. Now, before we get into the scent of this fragrance, I am gonna read out the notes that's in this scent. So in the top note of one million elixir, we have the apple, we have Davana, we have the middle note, so that Damas rose, that cedar, and we have that Osmanthus, which that is a new note. And the base note is that vanilla absolute, tonka bean, and that patchouli. So just by the notes that we just I just read out to you guys, this definitely is gonna be a winter and fall scent. Okay, but let's see. I'm going to spray this. You know what? I'm going to just spray this right here. I'm going to just rip this paper off. And we're going to see what we can get out of this. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. So it starts off a little bit fresh, green, aromatic, you know. Um. Then you get that rose note. That Damas rose, it is a very, very beautiful scent. It's it's a you get a floralness in this scent. It's so good, so good. Hmm. Wow. This is like a date night, and it is, and it, you get a fruitiness. You get a lot of sweetness in this scent. It's definitely a winter fragrance you know, all around. And this scent right here definitely is that cold, cold fragrance. This one million elixir is very sexy. It's very, you know, um, it's a floral. You get that freshness, you get that green. So it's definitely a jack of all trades when it come up to the notes in this scent. Um, and this scent right here definitely lasts a long time. I already know this scent, the projection goes crazy. The longevity, it's just so, so good. And the thing I, I like about this fragrance, like it leaves a vanilla, a, a, a sensual vanilla trail behind you. This scent right here definitely goes crazy. And it's just so, so good. You know, you just can't get enough of this scent. This one me elixir is just so good. And it's just very, very, very intriguing that this scent right here definitely brings out you know that charismatic version of yourself and that's what i like about this one million elixir because it definitely does that and it's just so so good so good definitely a compliment getter i've gotten plenty of compliments with this scent that's why i want it again you know well not that's why i want compliments i want it so i can smell good with this fragrance so i can have it in my collection again but other than that this scent definitely is a great uh, fragrance. It's a very sensual, sweet, fruity, aromatic, green. So it definitely transitioned to a fresh. And then you get that you get that rose note all throughout the wear time. And that vanilla absolute starts to pick up heavy. And that's all you can get in that uh, throughout the wear time. You do get that patchouli. So you get that rose, that uh, vanilla absolute. And then you get that patchouli, which is so, so good. It's so addictive. That's what I like about this scent. So 
Guys, if you got a girlfriend and you plan on wearing this scent, trust me, bro. I'm trying to tell you, she would not, she would not want you to wear it without her. If you if you going somewhere, she not gonna let you wear it. If she, if she not going with you, especially if you wearing this. Trust me, this one me elixir definitely is a great scent. Guys, go pick this up. It is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful scent. And so yeah, guys, this one me elixir definitely worth buying in 2024 i do recommend you guys getting this scent it's definitely a beautiful beautiful scent you know um but yeah guys go get it and then i, I don't know about this note it's like a osmathis note i did look on frantica it's like a flowery like a flower scent uh i mean flower note but i really can't smell it like that in this scent but I definitely get in that cedar, that the moss rose, that apple, that cedar, that vanilla, and plus that patchouli and that tonka bean. So it starts off fresh with the rose and then it transitions to a sweet fruitiness, uh, sexy, you know, scent. So, guys, I do recommend you go get this fragrance, this one me elixir. You would not be disappointed. I promise you guys, you would not be disappointing and i do have almost all the one millions in my collection i'm almost there i just need two more i just need the one million lucky and that one million um food so guys i hope you guys enjoyed this fragrance go pick this fragrance up please do it's definitely a good great awesome scent I literally just can't describe it. 10 out of 10, 1 million elixir. They did their thing with that fragrance. Very well balanced and very well made. So I hope every last one of y'all out there are feeling good, looking good, dressing good, and most importantly of all, smelling good. And I hope y'all out there having a blessed day. And it's your boy Trey Fragrance. And I will see y'all in the next video.